Thyroid is a small butterfly shaped gland in front of your windpipe. It releases thyroid hormone which controls the growth and metabolism of essentially every part of your body. Thyroid is under the control of pituitary gland which is a tiny gland in the middle of your head. Pituitary releases thyroid stimulating hormone that is TSH. TSH is the signal to the thyroid gland to release thyroid hormone. So hypothyroidism can be either primary or secondary. When the thyroid is unable to produce sufficient thyroxin despite the increased level of TSH, it is known as primary hypothyroidism. And when the thyroid is unable to produce sufficient thyroxin due to the lack of stimulus from TSH, it is known as secondary hypothyroidism. Women are 8 times more likely to develop a thyroid disorder than men. And when you are hypothyroid, your entire body slows down, including your ability to respond to your environment. So here are 12 common signs and symptoms of hypothyroidism. First is fatigue and sleepiness. This is the classic symptom of hypothyroidism. People with low thyroid feel a distinct lethargic tiredness or sluggishness which makes you feel unnaturally sleepy even though you have slept well the last night. When you are hypothyroid, you are less able to reach the stage 4 of sleep which is the deepest, most restful kind of sleep. So this may be the reason you are feeling tired and sleepy. So feeling sleepier more than usual without a good explanation could be a sign of hypothyroidism. You might also note that your reflexes are delayed. Second is gaining weight. Unexpected weight gain is another common symptom of hypothyroidism. Lack of thyroid hormone slows down your metabolism and your basal metabolic rate decreases. Because of this, you may gain weight. Now, if you have been experiencing weight gain, first you should look for other changes in your lifestyle which might explain this change. And if you seem to be gaining weight in spite of a good diet and exercise plan, it might be a clue to your hypothyroid condition. Third is digestive change. Because your system has slowed down, apart from the weight gain, you may also suffer from constipation, hardening of stools, bloating, poor appetite and heartburn. Since the food is not moving through your stomach as quickly as it used to move in a normal condition, you may experience acid reflux. Fourth is cold intolerance. In case of hypothyroidism, your basal metabolic rate decreases, which reduces the amount of heat you generate. And that's why low levels of thyroid hormone make you feel colder and more sensitive to cold than usual. So if you have noticed yourself feeling colder than the normal lately, then it might be a sign that you may be suffering from hypothyroidism. Fifth is weakness and aches in muscles and joints. Hypothyroid patients commonly complain of muscle aches and cramps. Low thyroid hormone shifts the metabolism towards catabolism. So the body breaks down its own tissues like muscles for energy. So because of this, muscle strength decreases and this leads to a feeling of weakness and pain. The pain may be severe enough to wake you up at night. So the treatment of hypothyroid hormone helps improve the muscle strength and it also decreases the aches and pain. Sixth is hair loss. Hypothyroidism makes your hair thin and dry and brittle. Low thyroid hormone causes hair follicles to stop regenerating which results in hair loss. But this will typically improve when the hypothyroidism is treated. The hypothyroidism may even cause coarsening of the hair. So consider hypothyroidism if you experience unexpected changes in the rate or pattern of your hair loss, particularly if your hair become patchy or coarser. Seventh is itchy and dry skin. Your skin may feel dry and coarse and it may flake upon scratching. Changes in skin that cannot be blamed on allergies or the use of new products can be a more practical sign of thyroid problems. Hypothyroidism is sometimes caused by autoimmune diseases and this can affect the skin causing swelling and redness known as myxedema. And myxedema is more specific to thyroid problems than other conditions which cause a dry skin. Eighth is feeling down or depressed. Depression in hypothyroidism is more frequent as compared to hyperthyroidism. 
And in one study, it was even seen that thyroid hormone replacement improved depression in patients with mild hypothyroidism. Ninth is trouble concentrating or remembering. Many patients with hypothyroidism may find it difficult to remember things or to concentrate at work. Difficulties in memory or concentration can happen to anyone. But if they are sudden or severe, then they could be a signal towards hypothyroidism. Tenth is menstrual cycle changes. If you are a female and hypothyroid, your menstrual periods will probably become much heavier and more frequent than usual. Both irregular and heavy menstrual bleedings are linked to hypothyroidism. Thyroid hormone directly affects the ovaries and uterus, so your ovaries may even stop producing or releasing an egg every month. And this can lead to difficult conception. Heavy bleeding may even result in anemia. So if you have a irregular or heavy period, do talk to your gynecologist. Eleventh is voice change. If your thyroid is enlarged, it may even affect your vocal cords and cause your voice to sound hoarse or husky. Twelfth, changes in fingernails. Your fingernails may become brittle and develop lines and grooves. You may even find it difficult to apply nail paint. So these were a few signs and symptoms that may be seen in case of hypothyroidism. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you.